evening. Here is the news. President Gorbachev has arrived in Peking today on the first leg of his Chinese tour. Hello, my name is Donald. <laughs> he was met at the airport by a crowd of half a million cheering Chinese troops. I'm the man who types out the news sheets. <laughs> the trip is seen as an important new step in the program of Glasnost. This is my last day at the BBC. <laughs> Labour MP John Thurwell launched a broadside attack on the government tonight over its handling of public sector pay rises. And quite frankly, I don't give a monkey's anymore. <laughs> he accused them of being arrogant and heartless over the issue. My leaving party went on all afternoon and quite honestly, I'm rat assed <laughs> Mr Thurwell pointed out that civil service pay had fallen in relation to the private sector by more than 15%. I'm leaving, I'm smashed and I feel bloody great. <laughs> In Rome today, the Pope got married. Yes, I can make you say anything. <laughs> After a brief ceremony in a registry office, the Pope and his bride, Demis Roussos, <laughs> flew off for their honeymoon to the small island of Belgium in the Dutch East Indies. <laughs> the City and the Financial Times Index rose today, then fell off its chair and had a fight with a pig. <laughs> a spokesman said, would you like to buy some of my spokes? And finally, on a lighter note, 14 people were massacred today in Kent by a runaway rhinoceros. A relative of the deceased said, we're all jolly glad. That's it. Next news at Christmas. Till then, good heavens. <laughs>